Hi guys, uh, let's see, today's topic will be geocaching. I know there's a lot of you that know what that is and there's a lot of you that don't. Uh, geocaching is um, a game that actually, or a sport or a game or whatever you want to call it, where actually uh, millions of people play it and uh, there's millions of geocaches all over the world um, but most of the geocaches are available in your own city they're everywhere they're hidden you probably walk by them all the time you never know it uh, what they are what it is is uh, I've explained on one of my uh, videos here about what it uh, what's involved you need um, containers to to hide something in uh, you don't necessarily have to put anything in them it can be it has to have a piece of paper in there where um, other geocachers when they find the geocache can sign it uh, and that's there's certain requirements for the game you don't have to pay any money it's a totally free uh, free game you can play you, you do need a few things I guess a GPS unit or um, an app for your, your phone or your tablet so that you can actually go and find these things and uh, put in the coordinates of where they are. And then you go to geocaching.com and uh, sign up and then start playing the game. So what's involved is you, you hide these things if you want to. You don't have to hide them. You can be just a finder and go out and find them. And uh, some people get pretty obsessed with uh, certain forms of the game like first to finds or number of finds they want to be the, the most they want to have the most the biggest the best the hardest the, the most and uh, some geocaches are very very easy to find some are con extremely hard to find um, all that information is given to you on the website uh, what kind of container it's in whether it be right from a micro to large uh, hidden in plain view right in front of you they're right there you walk up you see it you have to try to figure out how to get into it uh, to find that piece of paper is is another thing you have to actually find the paper to sign uh, you trade trinkets inside they sometimes they'll have uh, geocaching coins that you can take and move along and path tags and uh, all different kinds of, of, um, of uh, objects that are either in the containers or some of them don't have anything some of them are only big enough to to have a piece small piece of paper they're tiny they're magnetic they're they're hidden up under things they're hidden on top of things they're they're uh, they're not supposed to be buried in the ground although they can be covered with uh, with grasses or something and be covered up I think that's it right there. Easy find. Looks like it. All right. This is the container. Let me open this up. I actually have a stamp that I use. Now, what you've got to do is sign these things. And my geocaching name is King Tut. So where you can go online and watch the video, I I helped Darren make a, a, a video about the the, ge the geocache itself. Um, <clears throat> I think we did a pretty good job. So I encourage you to go to uh, DSK 11's uh, channel. I think it's GC DSK 11 is his channel. If you can't find his channel, just go on um, YouTube, type in unique geocache uh, hand trap
most people that live in in their vans uh they they name them uh, i don't know why but okay they name them so i'm sitting here thinking well yeah i should have a name too i can't call it my hut all the time so um if any of you out there can think of a name that would be appropriate for my my camper van put it in the comments and uh, what I can do is uh, I'll pick one that I like out of the out of the few that come in and uh, I'll send you a uh, one of my stickers the King Tut Hut so what I'm gonna do is when you send in your your names I don't know how long I'll, I'll wait for this to happen but uh, you send in your names and if I like any of them I'll pick one and uh, I'll send you out one of those um, one of those stickers or a couple uh, but make sure that you you put it in the comments so I can I can uh, get in touch with you and uh, get your address so I can uh, ship it off